Here's the deal. In Rocket League, your car is not merely a car. It's a rocket. But it doesn't really fly like a rocket. If you actually strapped a rocket to the back of a car, you wouldn't be able to turn it, and you'd probably fly into a mountain. Sadly, this means that there will probably never be real-life Rocket League. Oh my no! God! No! God, please, no! When your car's in the air, it actually functions less like a car, and more like a jet. To make this point clear, I'm going to be using this thing, basically because it looks like a plane, plus it sounds like So, the fastest way to turn your car sideways in the air is not to simply turn, but to twist your car sideways and then pull upwards. Obviously, you don't need to do this every time you turn your car in the air, but when you need to change your car's direction and momentum quickly, this is how you should do it. This is why many high-level players often fly sideways on their aerials or turn their car sideways to make quicker adjustments. There are countless other ways in which our little battle cars fly like cute little airplanes. You need to gain complete control over your car. You need to literally become one with your car. Kevpert has two videos on this that are in the description, but here are a few drills I've done to get better at car control. In my opinion, this is the single hardest thing to learn in Rocket League. It will literally feel impossible. You will want to give up. You'll say to yourself, I'm just not as good as those people. I might as well just end it all. Okay, keep practicing it every single day, and I promise things will start to click. Until that happens, you will not be using your car to its full potential, and honestly, you will probably mount to nothing in life.